Hi and welcome to the session. I am Asha and I am going to help you with the following question which says The relation f is defined by fx is equal to x square if x is greater than or equal to 0 and less than 3 and 3x when x is greater than or equal to 3 and less than or equal to 10. And the relation g is defined by gx is equal to x square if x is greater than or equal to 0 and less than or equal to 2. 3x if x is less than or equal to 10 and greater than or equal to 2. Show that f is a function and g is not a function. First let us learn that if a and b are any two sets, then a function f which is defined from A to B is a specific type of relation for which every element x of set A has one and only one image y in set B. That is, if x belong to set A, then f of x is equal to y where y belongs to set B and the element x of set A has only one in one image in set B. So this definition we will be using in this problem to solve it. So this is a key idea. So first let us show that is a function. Now, fx is defined by x square such that 0 is less than or equal to x is less than or equal to 3 and 3x such that 3 is less than or equal to x is less than or equal to 10. Now let fx is equal to y. To show f is a function, we will show that for every x, there is a unique y. Now first let x is equal to 0. Then y, which is equal to x square on substituting x as 0, get equal to 0. Then let x is equal to 1. Then y, which is x square, we have 1 square, gives y is equal to 1. Then let x is equal to 2. Then y, which is x square, will be equal to 4. And when x is equal to 3, y has two values. First is y is equal to x square which is equal to 9 and the second one is y is equal to 3x and on substituting x as 3, y becomes equal to 9. So, for x is equal to 3, y has a unique value, which is 9. And proceeding further, let x is equal to 4, then y will be equal to 3 into 4, that is 12. And similarly, like this, taking x is equal to 10, y is equal to 3 into 10, that is 30. So we see that for every x, there is a unique y. Hence, we conclude that for each x, such that x is less than or equal to 10 and greater than or equal to 0. There is a unique y. Such that the ordered pair x, y belong to the function f. This implies that the relation f, no two ordered pair have the same first element. And therefore, f is a 
function. Now let us show that g is not a function. Now gx is defined by x square such that 0 is less than or equal to x is less than or equal to 2 and 3x such that 2 is less than or equal to x is less than or equal to 10. Now let gx is equal to y and to show that g is not a function we will have to show that for some x there are two different values of y. So let us start with the x taking value 0. That is when x is equal to 0 then y which is equal to x square will be 0. When x is 1 y is 1. When x is equal to 2 y have two values. First is y is equal to x square and next is for x is equal to 2 y is again 3x and on substituting x is 2 we get 2 square is 4 and on substituting 2 here we get 2 into 3 is 6 and we see that for x is equal to 2 we have two different values of y and this shows that for a value of x, we have two different values of y. So this implies the ordered term 2 and 4 and 2 and 6 belong to G. For x is less than or equal to 10, greater than or equal to 0. So, this relation is not a function since they have the first element same which is 2 and hence g is not a function. So this completes the solution. Hope you enjoyed it. Take care and bye for now.